All right, friends, well, I just got done taking care of the Erdtree Guardian uh, dog, whatever that thing is, all right, here at the catacombs. We're going to zip on down to the coastline. We're going to do another one. We're going to enlist the aid of Knight Istvan. While we're going there, we might as well pick a few items here. If you see a mushroom or two, uh, or you see some smoldering butterflies, I use those to make fire pots. And the fire pots do pretty stinking well. Uh, in the last fight, you probably saw me just really make short work of uh, my enemy there. I hit him with a couple of fire pots. And it saved me on a couple of, uh, you know, I saved arrows by expending fire pots. So, I mean, that's a thing. Not really wanting to fight that guy. Let's go ahead and put a few things. All right. If you want some pinions to make more arrows, this is a great place to do that. All right? You just got to decide what you're going to do. Um, I could technically sneak up and try to get one. Let's see how good my... If you can sneak up on a freaking eagle, that's pretty stinking good. Right, why not practice a little bit of sneak? Just for the fun of it. Oh, that one saw me, but the other one didn't. All right, so there's tons and tons and tons of these guys around, by the way. When I say tons, there's these other little birds. I think these are the common myrrh, something of that nature. And they're kind of dumb. They'll just let you hit them. Now their buddy might run away, but you can just walk right up to him. Now you see these little footprints here, right? There is a invisible scarab beetle that you can jump off and try to get if you're fast enough. I think it's going to come right this way. I missed him. Not a problem. I'll get here. I'll use my special ability. And that will probably get him if I'm pointed in the right direction. As soon as he makes the corner, I should get him. Watch. I hear him dink tingling now. Oh, I was out of freaking mana. That actually totally makes sense. There we go, let's drink. Let's try again. A little humiliating, by the way. I was like expecting this super cool, you know. Ooh, I got him! Here we go, watch and bump. Cool, cool Ashervor. So again, you guys can come over here and you can. Ah, was it close, close enough? Um, you can walk up to most of these guys. You don't have to do a whole bunch of sneaking. Sometimes, if you're pretty handy. You might be able to get more than one. I got two with the special ability. How about only got one feather though, that sucks. Alright, this guy is that I'm gonna go fight is kinda tough, but he'll be a good uh, he'll be a, a good run for us to try to get a close range attack. If we can get a close range attack on him, that'll be pretty good. Start with the backstab. We'll sneak up on him. What am I gonna do? Don't know if I can even get this guy. Maybe. Nope. I'll have to stab this one the old-fashioned way. Oh, how I missed him on the first strike. We got him on the back strike. Okay. So this guy is pretty tough. He is a Kaiden warrior, big sword. Let's see what we can do damage-wise with the backstab. We might kill him in one hit. Big sneak, big stab. Did not kill him. Lock on, and go. That is a good assassination technique right there. And I got some smaller butterflies. That's really not who I came to kill, but I got a little bit of work done. Picked up a few pinions on the way. need these feathers, by the way, to make some extra arrows in my free time. All right, we're going to zip on over here. 
you don't get a lot of experience for killing these earth uh, you know, oct octopus guys. They're just going to eat up your arrows, you know, take forever to kill. Reward is minimal. They will drop an uh, octopus ovary of some sort. Not necessary for really much of anything that I'm going to build. Uh, yeah, totally, totally up to you if you really want them. <clears throat> so I do have a little bit of money. I don't think I've been... I don't think I've cleaned this guy out. And he's got smoldering butterflies. Need that for fire pots. Let's go and talk to you. need? I don't want any... Right, I definitely want that. Alright, I'll go ahead and take those. And whatever arrows he has left, I'll take those. I don't need that one. Alright, not trying to level up at the moment. Alright. Everything we're doing is setting up for the next big fight. Kind of keep that in mind. So this is a fun d little dungeon crawl here, the coastal cave. Um, I'm gonna, if you talk to Bach, he's over back where we were, uh, not far from where we were hunting those trolls. Um, he's usually here, all broken and beat up, but that's okay. All right, so I do not have a torch. It's going to be a little on the uh, in a difficult side, but what I do have is a lock-on button. So I'm gonna crawl this way, lock on. Oh look, there's a guy right there. I'm gonna sneak him. And what better environment than a dark cave to do a backstab? Right. Go back to crawl, creepy crawly. I'm gonna hug the right side of the cave. There's a lock on right there. I wonder if he sees me. Uh, he heard me, maybe. Oh, God, let's kill him. I guess he wasn't close enough. Let's see if I can get him here. Luckily, they're stupid because I couldn't see well enough to really hit him on the first hit. That's actually awful tactics on my part. Let's go back to Creepy Crawly here. <clears throat> Get in a crouched position. Now there's going to be more, right? we got to decide what we're going to do here. All right, I was going to shoot that with a bow. Let's get this one. Okay, cleaned out two of them. And there's another one. We can go ahead and hammer him with this bow. And by hammering him, I guess I meant kill him in one shot, really. All right. Nobody lock on to. Oh, there's a guy. That's the boss. Sweet. I love the speed of the knives, man. The blades are the daggers are awesome. Alright, so we see a little light at the end of the tunnel, right? There's a land octopus over here I was telling you about. Alright, so we're gonna summon an ally here, right? Knight Istvan. He's gonna help us out. We have to decide what our tactics are going to be. I'm going to drop back down to light load. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get on short bow. All right. I'm going to drop that. And let's go ahead and shall we make a few pots? Only get four, but that's okay. We'll use them. Okay, the merchants usually sell more pots. All right, let's take a look. So I've got <clears throat> bow is up and ready. I've got 98 arrows. That's pretty good. And I've got potions and some fire potions there. We're going to walk in and we're going to get this guy going to start with. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to switch this guy. This guy's not bad, but I'm going to use lone wolf ashes. Let's give him a try. Could also use these skeleton militiamen, which are kind of cool because they get, they will resurrect themselves until they get AOE'd. Um, so they kind of stick around for a while. But let's go with the uh, let's go with the wolves. Give the wolves a shot. All right, wolves are up. Istvan is ready. All right, I'm gonna go here. Throw 
everybody. That's why I do to get that yellow. Okay, so my whole plan was that Istvan was going to uh, help me. What a freaking... I really want to use profanity right now. What a butthole. Dude, this guy, man. There was a major glitch. I got him up. Why in the world he didn't help me? I will never understand. That pissed me off. I got to be honest with you guys. Really not cool. You know... And again, don't get me wrong. Somehow that was my fault. Fair enough. I tend to get really irritated sometimes when uh, things don't go my way. I'm just going to run down here and go right in. Forget all these guys.
left. Guys, let me just explain to you something. Number one, you probably could tell I was irritated. Number two, Istvan was supposed to help me and didn't. I don't know why. I went in without him, but because my mindset was different. I, you know what? I'm not going to use Istvan. Uh, I had a different result. All right. idea why this Vaughn freaking bailed on me. I That makes no sense to me. He's never ever failed me before, but I made it on my own. I ran right past everybody, even without him. I freaking kicked their freaking butts. That kind of really goes back to, you know, what are you thinking? What is your plan? And what are you going to do in the event that the plan goes to crap? In that case, the last time the plan went to absolute crap, right? What am I doing on life here? Got one health potion left. I think I'm trying to get to the other side real quick. There's two more guys. I think I got to fight, and they should be coming up here soon. There we go. Kind of still mad. Kill that guy. So again, my conservative approach to let the tank lead, when that failed and I was really in a bad position, <clears throat> I tried to make the best of it. That is not <laughs> how a good warrior fights. That is absolutely not good. All right. A good warrior's got a backup plan. And my backup plan was, you know, not to panic roll, and die, but ultimately I kind of ended up panic rolling a little bit. Trying to figure out who I could hit and who I couldn't hit. But I made it to the other side. Right. Just need to touch this grace. By the way, if you decide to be a faith based character, uh, you can get these cool dragon incantations. And the cool dragon incantations. Uh, are here inside this temple. Click on this and there they are. Dragon fire, dragon claw, dragon wall. I'm not a big fan of these to be honest with you. The dragon fire is not bad. Um, all of them take, they're a long, you know, long time, long casting time. And then the animation, you could be hit in the middle. So I don't really like it. Needless to say, we got this particular mission done. Uh, so all these areas here are now cleared. I'm gonna go over here, I think next and have a little bit of fun trying to backstab some other guys and we'll see how that goes. Um, guys, we're going to go back here to the Church of Ella and refit, which basically means get more arrows and kind of get my plan together. All right. This is your cool dude assassin, man. This is Black Blade. I hope you guys like and make sure that you like and share on social media and subscribe. Please subscribe. We'll see you guys. Peace.